In this video, I want to show you how to make a short to medium range anti-dog barking device. With this specific frequency generator, this should be effective up to about 25 feet. In this tutorial, I'm using a speaker box with small piezo speakers, a small 12 volt power supply, a 12 volt switch, general electronic tools, a soldering iron, as well as flux and solder, an ultrasonic frequency generator. For the first step, you will need to cut the end of the 12 volt power supply. You will then need to take the two wires and splice it in to the positive and negative side of the frequency generator. Make sure do not mix these up. Next step, you will need to put some small leads on the output of the frequency generator. There is no positive and negative here, so it doesn't matter which order. So I've just wired this like this, and then I put a small bit of solder right here. For reference, the outputs are very small wires. They look to be about 20 gauge wire. On one of the leads that you just connected, you will need to connect it to its switch. I've already attached one lead. I'm gonna demonstrate how to attach the next lead. With the switch wired in place, you will then have two leads that will output the signal. For the next step, you will need to make a speaker box and mount the speakers. What I did is I bought a cheap ammo box, I put banana jacks in the back of it. On the inside, I mounted the speakers with a hot glue gun, and I made little horns out of some funnels. You can see here I wired them in parallel. So at this point, you could connect these directly to the piezo speakers. This will output the signal needed to power the piezo speakers. As a demonstration, I've just hard connected them into these banana jacks here. So now I'm going to plug in the power supply. Since the switch is off, no power is going to the speakers. The reason I use this switch is the generator will produce a noise in the audible range as it powers up. So to make it completely inaudible, I have to flip the switch after the generator is powered on. Here's what happens if you power the generator on with the switch closed. As you can see, it makes a very loud noise in the audible range as it powers up. With the switch on, when you plug it in, it'll power up, but it won't be able to send the signal out. So now I'm going to flip the switch and show you how this can work. As you can see this lit up. When this is lit up, it means there's a load on it and the piezo speakers are outputting signal. This can still be outputting and not be lit up if there is very low power signal. When I plug this up to an amp, it does not light up because there's not a large load on it. I'm going to lower the frequency so you can hear it through the video. But that's all there is to it. What I ended up doing is mounting the box in a birdhouse so it's completely camouflaged and you don't know it's there. Only the dogs can hear it and they'll eventually stop barking once they get annoyed with it. If you do this over the course of a few weeks or maybe a month, they'll eventually be trained to know that if they bark, they will hear this noise and be annoyed. So that's what makes this so effective. You only need to use it when they bark to train them effectively.